world, it's, it's, it's in our culture, in our society, it's just people look at what they don't have so they can get what they want to have. But God's saying, no, you need to look at what you do have. Quit looking at what you don't have. Many years ago when I coached high school football, we, had, we built our own field. It was called the pasture. It was beautiful. We dedicated the field to the Lord. It was His. It was beautiful. We put, the, we, we put the sod down. We put the water drain or the irrigation in. We put the lights up. We put the bleachers in. We built a concession stand. We did it all with our hands. Myself and our students and our players, we did it with our hand. And our kids were so proud of the pastor. Well, we scheduled a game with this team. I'm not going to say their name. Big $4 million stadium. Top from a, town, a big town in Texas. I have great respect for those coaches, the leadership there, friends of mine. They showed up in this giant tour bus. They pulled up. We don't have a locker room. They have these beautiful locker rooms for home visitors. First class. They get to our field. They pull up. They get off the bus. And while my players are out stretching, going through their stretches, they get out and they laugh at our field. They laughed at our field. They started pointing at it. And they're like pointing at here. And so my guys were like, Coach. I called them in. I said, Guys, don't pay no attention to that. Well, that team was ranked very high at the state that year, and we were ranked probably 40, 50 below them out of 286 six man football teams. And at halftime, the coach asked if they could quit and go on home. <laughs> they got their tails whipped <laughs> on God's field. <laughs> now, those young men are God's too, okay? Don't hear me say that. They didn't face the wrath of God. They reaped what they sowed. <laughs> Amen. That's exactly Feel kind of good too. I can't <laughs> lie to you. But I just told my players, I said, look, what's really important? Does it matter? Look at what you do have and quit looking at what you don't have. That four million dollar stadium does not win you football games. What wins you football games is what's in you, the heart. It's the truth. I'll take a team with heart any day over a team with talent. And that's the way it is in the kingdom. Amen.